What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we're back in Gold Rush, the game. But open hill. Got some uh, work done a little bit on the uh, on the, the fun shenanigans that we have rocking and running over there. On our hole. Doing some work. And as you can see in the top right, I got a bunch of cash. And we just passed a bulldozer. Oh yeah. Our last episode was on Monday? Monday? Tuesday? Monday? Monday or Tuesday? Since then, I... I just got super duper bored with this game. <laughs> it's just digging in the dirt. Found the place that I got hurt. It's just a lot of uh, going into the dirt, digging it up, dropping it in. Going to the dirt, digging it up, dropping it in. And our employees make a bunch of cash for us. Well, I would say they have a bunch of gold, which translates into a bunch of cash. So I had a little experiment where I wanted to see how much gold our little workers can make in one day. Hold on, loading, loading, Bueller, Bueller. And uh, each day takes about an hour ish, roughly, roundabouts, give or take. And on the first day, I rocked in around, uh, I had it written down here, around 16 gold is what they made. And then it's like, yeah, and that varies every once in a while too. So it's anywhere between 15 and 18 gold. I just was on the lower end at the beginning because it was like 12 to 15 and then I hired a second, uh, not another worker, a uh, second worker, another worker for the bulldozer because I purchased the bulldozer and then I just uh, kept on doing it over again. So I'm spending around $6,700 a day with rent, our loan, and our employees. Yes, thank you for the differential warning. And on top of that, let's curl it in here. We're making anywhere between 12 to 15 gold, and now we're making anywhere between 15 to 18 gold ounces per day, just from the workers. So, what I was doing is, uh, don't tell my bosses or anything, I would uh, uh, team viewer in for my work, because I work on computers. I would team viewer into my computer, and then just let this bad boy run. And I would sit here, and let the workers do their thing. Just cashing in. Now with TeamViewer and everything, the lag was super crazy, so I couldn't actually play the game. But I was basically just standing here melting down Baz and then selling it for profit. And then when I get home from work, do a little work on the uh, on the fam, on the farm, on the uh, gold mine. Speaking of gold mine, we're gonna melt this gold. Boom. And we're gonna make some sweet cash. So as you can see, day 44. Um, when I'm at work, I just let it roll and I kind of take a glance at it. Say hi to it. Sell some gold. And go about my merry way. It takes about like five minutes. But that's okay. Because I can take it in I can do that in between calls sometimes. So that's what I was doing. Coming home. And I'm like, alright, I'm done with this game. Give my computer a rest. Did that for a couple of hours. And then I would even come home and I would just let it roll. I was like, alright, I'm good. Go downstairs and make dinner. Let the workers do their thing. I mean, that's why I'm paying them. You know what I'm saying? So, we've racked up. It's now day 44. I believe the last time we were in this, like day 27, day 28. So, many days, many days have passed. And we're going to sell some gold bars. And then we're going to go buy that conveyor belt because that's what I was really working for. To begin with, $183,000. Now, the gold that I was making, I wasn't filling up that, uh, the large, uh, the large tier 3 mining facility all the way to the tippy top I would just uh, g uh, would keep on playing until I'm just like all right I'm good let's sell this stuff and just make a little bit of extra gold a little bit of extra cash I think we're halfway through them almost halfway through our first month so we only have 35 40 some odd days so we took our loan whoa, whoa whoa well we took our loan out I believe in day 23 that's a 60 day loan so we got a bit but every day Every day we get closer and closer. So, every single day, we're making about 16, uh, I would say roughly averaging out to 15 to 18 gold. So say we get 16 gold ounces per day, we sell that off, that's around $20,000. That's a profit of around thirteen dollars to $15,000 per d d d day. Plus all the gold that I was trying to mine out whenever I would come home from work and say hi. And that's why we're here. That's why, you, that's why it took a whole week to try and <laughs> get you an episode, because I was like, I want to do an experiment. Now, am I going to do that all the time? Absolutely not. 
I think this may be one of the final episodes until they do another update and get us some more cool things. So what we're going to do today, I just pa I passed it. We're going to go buy the conveyor belt. I'm too busy chatting with y'all. Too busy joshing. So let me go over and purchase all of our gear. And come on. Oh, my. Differential. Differential, come on, baby. We get the conveyor belt. We'll grab our large excavator, move it around, get it fired up, and start digging in the dirt and see what it looks like when we drop it in. I don't know if it's going to help productivity, per se. I think it's just kind of a nice little extra, it's a cool little feature, and then uh, your, uh, your front end loader and stuff won't get caught. Plus you can uh, fill up a dump truck, and I believe you can also dump the dump truck into the conveyor, which is super duper handy. Like literally, you have to take an excavator, drop it in there, or a front end loader, and then just drop it in there. Someone wants to work for me. Good for them. And then dump it in the dumpster, and then we will bring it over. I don't know why we're in Russian. It's because we're in Alaska. We're so close. Uh, let's see. And we're here. Oh, conveyor, you're mine. You are so mine. Stay right there. You stay right there. Oh, you stay. You, you hurry. All right, most expensive thing. Foist. Uh, just one, please. And our bucket. Wunderbar. Uh, yeah, it's very good. It's very good. Fiesta, fiesta. Hut. Check it out. Check it out. Order. Boom. Boom. Confirm. Now, before we started recording, I went and got a whole bunch of cables. Because I broke all my other ones. Huh? Okay, so. Let's hop on over. And I do have my cables over near my shed. Ha ha ha. My shed. My shed. Well, what did you say to you? You heard me. My shed. Ha ha ha. Now, I did get some 4 meter cables. I'm going to give those a try real quick. And see how well they do. I'll see how well they rock and roll with it. Let's get with it. String connection to Mac. But sometimes I get ridiculous. Uh, let's see. Alright, here. Let's dip that down low. Dip it low. Pick it up slow. You wanna hang on? You wanna pop? Pop, pop that thing, little Christina Million. I haven't heard that song in a long time. Uh, let's see, hood, boom. There you go. One cable for you, one cable for me. Gonna drop these cables and see how we can plan things. Yeah, let's find the last one. Oh yeah, we're full. We're so metal right now, like literally, we're holding metal. All right, and boop, boom. There we go. Hop, skip, and a jump. Sorry for the camera angles. All right, we'll hop you up. Turn around. Nailed it. Like literally, okay. So there's the hookups. Excuse me. Yeah, y'all want to hook up? I don't think we're. I think we'll probably have to. Is that gonna reach? No, nope, of course not. All right, all right. You got me. You got me. Okay. Now the real question is. Can I take you and... I can! Seven meters. I don't need you stinking seven meters. I got you seven meters right here. All right, let's go ahead and we'll grab you. We're gonna hoist you out. I was determined. I was like, nah, I think I could do this. All right. Up, Gunther, up! Up we go. 
We are strongly bull. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and spin our booty around here a little bit. Sound good? Alright. Now let's pray that these ropes don't snap. Oh, and of course I have it. Uh, I have it the wrong way. I would have it the wrong way. Diesel, you're literally, literally taking this the wrong way. Whatever. Whatever. I'm just spinning around. We'll spin around. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Come on. Watch out for the fuel tank. Don't want to explode like one of them shooter games, baby. In every shooter game, the fuel tank always explodes. How do you know that? I just know things. What, what was that? What is that black? What is what's going on here? Hey, look at that. Kobe. Alright. And now we're off to get we're off to get the bucket. The wonderful bucket of, of this. Because, 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 because. Because we want to dump a load into the bucket and we're stuck on something. We're off to get the bucket. The wonderful bucket of diesel. The wonderful bucket of gold. I love gold. Alright. So. The speed of you is thrilling. It's amazing. Now, this will be interesting, my friends. My friends, my friends. Alright, so let's go ahead. We'll drop this down low. Oh, look at that. We're almost in the center. Don't stress. Don't, don't be stressing. Don't stress me out, bruh. Don't stress me out. Alright. Up. Good, good. You are there. Excellent. You are here and you are there. And that's how hooks work. Boom. All right. All right, if you go up a little bit faster, I'll give you a treat. Up, doggy. Here, doggy, doggy, doggy. Up, doggy. There we go. Spinning around. Oh, yeah. This is going to be so nice. Especially if we get a dump truck. Which eventually we will. All I have to do is just uh, let it sit here for a couple more days. A couple more hours. That's it. That's what I'll do. That's what I'll do. I'll make a little... I'll, I'll get a little gold. Do a little dance. Make a little love down tonight it's like whenever I'm not playing anything else I'll just load this up and just let the workers work doing the work hey oh well, maybe we might be able to, we'll, we'll, can't talk we might be able to hire another worker not quite sure all right out hey and we're all kinds of full of good stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, 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 right. Release the handbrake to move the machine. Nope. Not gonna do it. Beep. 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 All right. Park you. Turn you off. Quiet you. You did a good job there, four meter, four meter uh, cables. It's nice. Well, looky here. So we need electricity. I got you electricity right here. I got do have a port there and another cable. I think we have to go purchase another cable. Hut. Can we hire another worker for this kind of uh, kind of kind of operation? Sixty-one percent. Forty-one. Hmm. Expensive. 12 hours. 62. 66. I like it. Hmm. 
Mm. Cletus. I like you. Higher. I don't know. Something about the, I like the cut of his jib. I like how he doesn't look like this guy. Can we assign him? Ah, we can't. Not just yet. Oh man. Well, Cletus, nice knowing you, homie. All right, so we'll cancel out of you, shut you down. And I do have an electrical cable, but we will have to get another one. So give me a hot second. I will be right back, and we're going to fire this thing up and see how well it do. All right? Okay. Okay, so I picked up two cables just in case, but the one cable that I did have did reach over to our bucket. So that's good. Good. I like how these also get labeled too when you plug them in. So we'll go around this way, and if not, we have a connector and an extra cable now too, but we won't need it. Fantastic. It's beautiful, man. It's beautiful. All right, well, let's go fire this bad boy up, and we'll start digging here a little bit, baby. There we go. Hood. Hood. All right, let's see if I can get stuck again. Trauma. Shaker. Conveyor belt. Conveyor belt container. Stop. All right. Now we got 52% on one side, 36 on that side. So, yeah, it's doing a little bit. Doing okay. It's usually like I would uh, rock and roll for like an hour. And then after about an hour or so, I'm like, all right, man, I'm good. I, I, I mind for a day. Making some close, we're almost close to our, uh, our original start point. Come out. I was working at night. So the future's so bright. Conveyor belt's rolling, baby. The conveyor belt, she is rolling. Q, differential lock, clown. Let's get our digging on, baby. Now, I also made another trip because we had to fill up our electrical, uh, our electric joint, our electric cargo container, whatever you want to call it. We had to fill that up with some gasolina. Let's turn it up. Turn it up. Oh, we dropped a little bit. Our mound is surmounting to a point where we're probably going to have to get that dug out as well. We'll see. We'll see. But first, we're here for the conveyor belt. She's here. She is gorgeous. She's ours. Next will be the dump truck. Now, I'm not sure exactly how this uh, affects productivity. I'm sure that if you take your dump truck and fill it up and just load it in there, it'll work a lot better. Plus, you won't get your, uh, your front end loader stuck on the shaker, which happens to me quite often because I don't pay attention. Let's lock everything up. Dip down. Ninvigoya. Can we see? I wanna see. I'm stuck. I'm trapped. Alright. Okay. It's looking mighty fine. Mighty fine indeed. Every time I see a machine like this, I'm automatically reminded of Willy Wonka. Very, very cool, man. Very, very cool. The conveyor belt, she is ours! And she's gorgeous. She is pretty, y'all. Oh, she's pretty. So... I'll probably go ahead and finish up this uh, load, if you will, and have ourselves a good time, get some monies, drop it in there, but for the most part, I'm going to let the workers do their thing, chicken wing, know what I'm saying. They're killing it. They're straight killing it. Fire, sir. Fire. Now, it's a shame. It's a shame, really. I'll have to check out to see if now, oh, maybe our workers can, uh, since we fired it up, we can assign a worker to this. Hold on. I'm not aware. Let's 
Just dig you up, Buttercup. Beautiful. Yeah, a dump truck would be fantastic as well. That way we can just drop it in here with us. And then we'll get the big excavator. And then just dump ourselves in a good time. Or front end loader. It's all dependent. I'm sure once we widen out. I don't know how deep this goes, though. Will it go to the center of the earth? No. No, it's not going to do anything like that. But... Let's go ahead here. I'm trying to think best for the thumbnail. Uh -huh. Ah, worry about the thumbnail later. We'll do it for the thumbnail later. No, 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 no. Incorrect. Incorrect posture, sir. That posture's incorrect. You're right. You're right. And when you're right, you're right. So come on now. Oh, come on now, buddy. Up. Oh. Thing as slow as molasses. All right. Good stuff. So, folks, that's going to be our episode for today. Our conveyor belt, she's in with a grin. And next on the list is the dump truck, which is $148,000, something ridiculous. So, we got a ways to go. But you know what? It's all about doing that work with her a little bit. It's all about getting in with a grin. Yes, sir. Oh, come on. Come on now. Fantastic. Set it up. Set it up for the kill. Hold on here. First thing, let's check to see if we can assign a worker now that we turned it on. I'm up the, going up the stairs. I'm stuck on the stairs. I'm stuck on the ladder. Help. Help. There we go. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. So I, I can't assign. Nope. Can't. Nope. Guess not. Well, do we can. What's our uh, stock looking like now? Oh, gold has shot up, sir. $1,234. Word. Uh, it was a little bit, yeah. I thought it, it was dipping down to there for a little while. For a day or so. But, tis what it is. It is what it is. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. Helps out my channel deliver so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week. Folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Peace out, like shout, y'all. And I will check you out right here again in <laughs> Gold Rush, the game, next time.